Hey, what's up, everybody? Adobe Masters here, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to add a logo in Premiere Pro. So let's get started on this. The first thing you wanna do is to create a new layer in your graphics panel. This is slightly different than a lot of people teach, and I'm gonna show you why you wanna do it this way. You're gonna go from File, and then find whatever icon you're using. So in this situation, I'm going to just be using the, let's go with uh, my logo. So I grab my logo, I bring it in, and now we have it centered right here. So once we click on the graphics layer, we can then expand it or contract it however long we want. So we'll bring it up to the, the duration of the clip here. Now up here, we have the ability to move it, shrink it. We can really just click on it and drag it. Once you get to the essential graphics panel, you click on this and you can move it and drag it. Also over here in effect controls, you'll see that over in the graphics as long as the graphics layer selected. If we go to the clip and go down, we have all those position markers as well. So let's scale it down a little bit, move it into place. And like I said, you can put it in any place you want. I'm gonna move it right here in the bottom right. Or let's go in the top right, because I think bottom right, sometimes YouTube will take that. Top right, and then we'll take the opacity, and we can bring that down just a touch, maybe right around 80%. And that just allows it so it doesn't interfere with the background. You can still see through it a little bit. And so now that we have it created, moved, opacitied, this is why we created in a graphics layer. Because now we can go up to graphics, export as motion graphics template, and we'll name this logo. Click OK. It's going to do its thing really quick. And then once it's done, now we don't ever have to do that again. Anytime we want to add ourselves a logo, we go into the browse and we search for our logo. And we just need to look for the logo design right here. There, my logo is. Maybe we need to name it something different because there's a couple other things that pop up. But you can see it's right here. All I got to do is drag and drop it on. And my logo is over any footage, anytime. And that makes it really, really quick to be able to do. And what's even better is you can adjust the length of the logo. So it's not like you have to do anything. Now, anytime you need to add this to your footage, go to Essential Graphics, drag it on, match the length, and you're good to go. Thanks everyone for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, go and throw in the comment section below or on our website at adobemasters.net. If you guys would like to learn Premiere Pro from scratch or you would like to master Premiere Pro, check out the course in the description below. It is a fantastic course on how to learn Premiere by doing just this, tutorial-based lessons. You're gonna start off basic and it's slowly gonna get more and more complex and you're gonna have real world applications with every single lesson. By the end of it, you'll have mastered everything you can do in Premiere Pro, so give that a quick look. Thanks everyone and until next time, see ya.